A recurrence is an equation or inequality that describes a function in terms of its values on smaller inputs. There are several methods for solving recurrence relation. Iteration method, recursion tree method and master's method. Here I am going to discuss about master's method. The master's method, the relation should be like this. T of n equal to a into t of n by b plus theta of n power k into log power p of n. And a should be greater than or equal to 1. b should be greater than 1. k is greater than or equal to 0. And p is a real number. E recurrence relation on the angle, we can solve this using master's method. And here there are three cases. If A is greater than B power K, equal to B power K and less than B power K. If A is greater than B power K, then our time complexity is theta of n raised to log A to the base B. If A equal to B power K, then there are three sub cases. P is greater than minus 1, equal to minus 1 and less than minus 1. The first case, time complexity is theta of n raised to log a to the base b into log raised to p plus 1 of n. In second case, t of n is theta of n raised to log a to the base b into log of log n. In third case, t of n is equal to theta of n raised to log a to the base b. And if a is less than b power k, there are two sub cases. p is greater than or equal to 0 and p less than 0. The first case t of n is theta of n raised to k into log raised to p of n. Uh, in the second case t of n is equal to p of n power k. The first question is t of n equal to 7 into t of n by 2 plus n square. Here a is equal to 7, b equal to 2. And n square is theta of n square into log raised to 0 of n. Log raised to 0 o of n is equal to 1. So, namukka n raised to k log raised to p n nolla dhidhil vayanam edhaan. So, n square into log raised to 0 of n. And here k is equal to 2 and p equal to 0. And find b power k. It is 4. Then, uh, check a and b power k. Here, a is greater than b power k. So, this is case 1. If a is greater than b power k, then t of n is theta of n raised to log e to the base b. So, then here a is 7 and b is 2. The answer is theta of n raised to log 7 to the base 2. The next question t of n is 2 into t of n by 2 plus n log n. Here a equal to 2, b equal to 2 and n log n is theta of n raised to 1 into log raised to 1 of n. k is equal to 1 and p equal to 1. Find b power k. It is 2. Then check a and b power k. Both are same. a equal to b power k and check the value of p. Here value of p is 1. It is greater than minus 1. So t of n is theta of n raised to log a to the base b into log raised to p plus 1 of n. So write t of n then theta of n raised to log 2 to the base 2 into log square of n. P is equal to 1, so P plus 1 is 2. Then log 2 is 1. So the answer is theta of n into log square of n. The third question, t of n is 2 into t of n by 4 plus square root of n. Here a equal to 2 and b equal to 4. And square root of n is n raised to 1 by 2, which is equal to theta of n raised to 1 by 2 into log raised to 0 of n. Here k is equal to 1 by 2 and p equal to 0. Find b power k. That is 4 raised to 1 by 2 it is 2. Here a and b power k are same. So here a is equal to b power k. Then check the value of p. Here 
here p is 0. And if p is greater than minus 1, then t of n is theta of n raised to log a to the base b into log raised to p plus 1 of n. And write t of n, then n raised to log 2 to the base 4 into log raised to p is 0. 0 plus 1 is 1, log raised to 1 of n. Uh, and n raised to log 2 to the base 4. 2 to the base 4, the answer is 1 by 2. n raised to 1 by 2 into log of n, which is equal to theta of square root of n into log n. Next question, t of n equal to 2 into t of n by 2 plus n divided by log n. Here a is 2, is equal to 2 and b equal to 2. And n divided by log n is, 1 divided by log n is log raised to minus 1 of n. So n raised to 1 into log raised to minus 1 of n. Here k is equal to 1 and p is equal to minus 1. Find b power k. It is 2. A and B power K are same and the value of P is minus 1. And here A is equal to B power K and P equal to minus 1. Then time complexity is theta of N raised to log A to the base B into log of log N. Write T of an equation and then N raised to log 2 to the base 2 into log of log N. Log 2 is 1. So the answer is theta of N into log of log N. Next question, t of n is equal to 3 into t of n by 2 plus n square. a equal to 3 and b equal to 2. And n square is theta of n square into log raised to 0 of n. Here k is equal to 2 and p equal to 0. Find b power k. It is 4. Here a is less than b power k. And if a is less than b power k, there are two cases, p is greater than or equal to 0 and p less than 0. In our case, p is equal to 0. So, if p is greater than or equal to 0, then t of n is theta of n raised to k log raised to p of n. Write the equation, then uh, which is equal to theta of n square into log raised to 0 of n, which is equal to theta of n square. It is the answer. Next question, t of n is equal to 2 raised to n into t of n by 2 plus n raised to n. As per, as per master's theorem, a should be greater than or equal to 1. In our case, a is 2 power n. So, we cannot solve this relation using master's method. Thank you.